All right, guys, let me tell you a story. Now, this is a story about a triplet brothers, okay? I don't even know the right terminology for it, but there's three brothers in Chicago and the viral photos of them passing away year after year is going viral right now. But I want to I want to give you a story before we we talk about that first. Now, when I was a rapper many years ago, I met FBG Duck, all right? FBG Duck was from 63rd, okay, Chicago. I'm from New York. So he came to New York to shoot a music video with my friend, okay? I went to shoot a video with Billionaire Black called Bars on Deck, all right? And also used to be with Workboy, okay? Now, when I did these two songs, I met FBG Duck. Very tall guy, all right? Um, I never knew this guy would pass away. I never knew how much beef he had until... I followed his career when he left. Now, I, I looked at Bye Bye. I looked at um, Billionaire Black with his songs. I looked at when they made songs together, it was just different. Now, the thing about this situation, the reason why I'm talking about FBG Duck is because he's from Chicago. Now, me meeting him, right, him being from Chicago, little, New York is a little different, all right? People don't die that frequently. All right. People probably die every three years or something like that. Four years. At least you got a chance to make it out. But it looks like in Chicago, it's a different type of story. And the story is, is a three. I don't even know how to explain it. Three brothers. Right. in Chicago around 15 years of age. They basically they look young. They look exactly the same. Identical triplets. All right. You should be happy to even have brothers. I was a single child. Now, the reason why I'm saying all of this is basically to give you a glimpse into reality. There is no gun control. There is no respect when it comes to the streets. All right? People don't want to fight no more. People just want to take your life away. Now, I just covered a story where Matt Hardy was dissing Lil Dirk, right? And he was basically talking about, yeah, my account. My Twitter account got hacked. But then I go on his story. It's like you can see the promotion for a w AEW event. And then you're talking about your Twitter got hacked. Like, come on, bro. Like, like, make it make sense. Everybody wants the clout. And I understand that. But nobody understands what comes with the clout. It may be bullets behind the clout. It may be your friends dying behind the clout. It could be all type of things. Now, the reason why I say you know, my story about FBG Duck early on in the video is because he called himself and his friends the Clout Boys, all right? Do I need to go any further with this? What I'm really trying to get to is that not even if you're a rapper, wrestler, model, singer, death is promised. That's the only thing that's promised in life. So while everybody wants to be disrespectful, everybody want to say gang, gang, and gang, gang, and bang, bang, and all this, they got manipulated to fall in love with a certain type of music, a certain type of culture, but look at the result of that. A lot of people are strung out on fentanyl. A lot of people are losing their life early on before they can even reach their potential. We don't know if you was going to be a crack baby 15 years old. Like, you still have promise. I don't know how old FBG Duck was when he died, but meeting him, he did not want to get in my video unless I paid him. So he got to be street smart. Definitely business smart. But I say that to say this, man. Nothing is promised but death. And seeing these three men basically go through this traumatizing experience, two of them passing away, and one has to basically bear the story. Man, when are we going to stop the violence? I know Lil Durk has said stop the violence, but he's beefing with NBA Youngboy and 6 9 at the same time. So... NBA young boy talking about he regrets all the stuff that he said in the past. But do does he really? You know what I'm saying? So it's just tough, man. All right. I'll just I'll just give y'all a video from the heart. All right. Yo, it's your boy LB Moolah. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Definitely turn your post notifications on because you drop videos every single day and you would not want to miss it. It's your boy. Let's get it.